Hello, and welcome to the very first episode of PC Building Simulator. Now, I know that they came out with a PC Building Simulator 2, but currently I do not have a PC to run that on um, because it is a PC exclusive. But this was on sale over the holidays this year and I decided to pick it up now I have played this before I do have it on my Nintendo Switch and I haven't played a ton I played it like pretty much when it first got released on the Switch and I know there's been tons of updates uh, since then um, so I'm interested to hop into it and I, I do know there are a whole bunch of of expansions um, so that I don't know that might be something we look into later but let's jump right into it yep that's fine okay so these are just so these are just like different workshops or whatever interesting See, I haven't checked. I'm pretty sure I have all of these on the Nintendo Switch. Um, but I don't know. I haven't. I've never checked them out. So let's jump in, just to the base game here. Okay. Now the reason I wanted to play this game on the channel is because I do have a younger audience, and I think it would be good to play this game. And it's very, very, very educational in terms of learning PCs and how they work and how they're built and so forth. So I'm very interested in that aspect of the game. And I think it would be good for everyone on the channel, even myself, kind of freshen up. Yo. We got some old game consoles. It's crazy. We've got some old speakers down there. Oh, this is our inventory. Gotcha. Cloud notes. Okay. I don't know what cloud notes are, but we'll get into it. Okay. So, let's see what we got here. So, let's load up our email. Pretty much everything comes through email in the shop. Okay. So welcome to your new PC shop. Hey, thanks for taking over the PC shop for me. Sorry it's not in a better state. A few things. The company isn't doing very well and there's no money in the bank account. Uh, I see that. We're at negative $15. <laughs> the rent and energy bills come out monthly, so make sure you have enough money for them. I had a job on the go, which should help with the rent. See the email below. Remember to use your thermal paste when putting in a CPU. I almost always forget, and the PCs overheat. Oh, Uncle Tim. So I think you're all set up. It's your company now, so run it how you see fit. I hope you do better than I did. Lots of love, Uncle Tim. P.S. I had to borrow $15 for fuel. You know how it is. So that's why we're negative $15 in the hole. Okay, so first off, Uncle Tim, come on. Thermal paste is like super easy to do come on hi Tim I hope you can help me my computer has been running slower than usual and I think I might have clicked on something I shouldn't have do I have a virus thanks Gary okay all right Gary you want us to remove your viruses huh hundred dollars look at that all right so we do already have the PC look at this let's pick it up pick it up bring it to our table over here Awesome. Press three or the cables button to plug the monitor, keyboard, mouse, and power into the back of the PC. Now, I know for a fact that there are upgrades later on that you can get that automatically plug in cords and uh, screws and so forth. Okay. Now you need to put your USB drive into the back of the PC so you can install the virus scanner. Press one or the small install button. To go into your inventory and select the USB drive. 
it plugs into the USB slot in the back of the PC. So let's install the USB drive. Nailed it. Press P to power on the system. Okay. So install the virus scanner. So it's loading the OS system. We'll go up here to add and remove programs. Let's install the virus scanner. Once it's done downloading, we have to restart the PC. Instead of clicking yes, I usually just power it off and back on. I don't know, it's just habit for me, I guess. Just habit. Uh, let's run the virus scanner here. Jeez. 454 files infected. My dude. Okay, when you're done, you always want to make sure you remove all the programs from their PC. That's just, you know, courtesy. What's nice is the game automatically unplugs our USB for us. So we can just pick our PC up and we can put it in whatever, the delivery area. Okay, so let's go here and it says it's done. So we can collect. And we got a hundred dollars. Nice. Come back tomorrow, see if there's any jobs to do. Alright, so we can just delete this email. Something to look forward to. Hey, read an online read an article online about business principles and it got me thinking. It's time I took Tim's Red Hot Repairs back to its roots. Top priority, I set up a website. The article said you're nobody if you're not on the web. Take a look when you're when you got a minute www.timsredhotrepairs.com Seriously, open up your browser and check it out. It's a real website. Took me hours to get it all working. As for next steps, I've got an eye on a few local properties. The money I'd need is tied up in the old workshop of yours, but I'm sure I can think of a quick fire way to get the cash. Anyways, just have a look at the website. Let me know what you think. I'll keep you updated. Excited for the future, Uncle Tim. P.S. Do you keep any flant flammable anything flammable in the old workshop and if not do you think maybe you could start <laughs> okay so essentially he wants it to light fire so he can get other properties hashtag insurance money that's not going to happen we run a tight ship Tim alright here he is again hello I was building a PC earlier and I forgot which power supply to buy to support the 380 I just added is something someone who is not using my new cloud notes app would might say have you been forgetting things needing somewhere to note what you're working on you could try cloud notes it's a great app where you can write notes for PC building and check them whenever you need to it's pretty handy it should be with all the other apps ready to install hope it's helpful Uncle Tim I've also given you access to a prototype I'm working on which will enable this app in your inventory as well nice well, we can install that. So I've never used the Cloud Notes app um, in the game before. I don't know. Maybe it's good. I guess we'll see. Heading, note text. Interesting. So we don't need that right now. Alright, we can check that out tomorrow. So let's power off our PC. Oh, this is our calendar here, so, and we'll see this in a minute, but essentially we just go through the month, and we have to pay utility bills here, and then pay our rent of $500 here. Now it's important that we shut our lights off before we leave, or that'll run up the electricity bill. All right, end of day, so we can end our day and then go on. All right, let's go to work. Let's turn our lights on here. If I can hit it. Alright, let's see what we got. $85 in bank. Alright, hi there. I just wanted to say thank you for fixing my PC. It's booting faster than it has in years. I didn't realize your uncle had gone away. Looks like the business is in good hands, though. You bet, Gary. Could you have a look at my PC, please? It isn't running as well as it did when I first bought it, and I've probably not been taking the best care of it. So it's a bit dirty. 
not running as well. Could you give it once over, please? If you can, I'll bring it around tonight, right if you're in the morning. <clears throat> All right, P. Sherman. Remove viruses, clean dust. Easy. Okay, broken graphics card. My graphics card has fried itself and I need it to be replaced with the same one, please. NVIDIA GTX 970. Maybe one of those Sheen ones. So we got to buy a Sheen GeForce GTX 970 Gamer. So let's go into the shop here. In the shop, we got to go to graphics cards. Scroll down. So main brands are GeForce, uh, like the MSI ones. Those are the main ones. Um, EVGA is another one. And then the Sheen ones down here. So we need a GeForce GTX 970 Gamer. Let's add that to the cart. Perfect. And yep. And then more space on my computer. I need some more space to back up my files. Could you install 500 gigabyte HDD, please? Bring it around first thing. All right, so there's HDD and SSD. Um, I can't remember what HDD stands for, but SSD stands for solid state drives. Um, yeah, I, I can't remember what HDD stands for, but all you have to know is that it's your storage in your computer. So 280 bucks, budget of $50 to get the new piece. So let's accept that. So we got to come in here. Let's go to storage. Um, 500 gigs. Oh, we only have one that's 500 gigs. So more Tony Easy Store, 500 gigabytes. It is type HHD. See, these are SSDs. Okay, HHD. Let's add to cart. All right, let's view our cart. So use the delivery options to choose when best to receive your components. Often it's better to pay for faster delivery than wait days to receive things. All right, so we could wait three to five days and only pay ten dollars. We can get same day delivery, which is a hundred dollars, and then next day delivery, which is thirty. So let's just do next day, which of course we overdrew on the account. Valued customer. Here at Megacorp, we know that life doesn't always run smoothly. So we provide a free overdraft for all our customers. Your free overdraft limit is $1,000. Okay, so we can go in the hole $1,000 and not have to pay money. All right, well, since that's it and we have no PCs to work on, we can end our day. Well, that's a nice easy day, huh? Nice. So this kind of shows us which ones we've taken. Pick it up. Okay. Sweet. So we check our, our uh, packages, which we got the graphics card and the HDD. Storage. Turn the lights on. And let's get to work. <clears throat> so if you hover over it, you can say PC can boost OS, install the hard drive. All right, let's do that one first. Let's place it down. Let's see. Now, what it looks like in the case, we need to install the hard drive from here. So let's unscrew the screws. Yep, we sure do. Let's open the drive bay. We want to install our storage this one and then we of course need to connect the cables each one has two so there's two cables one that connects to the motherboard one that connects to the power supply I'm pretty sure that or they might both connect to more the board. I don't know. It depends on the PC. I'm pretty sure. Uh, and then we need to install 
go to PC parts, and then we gotta just install this back panel. Of course. All right. Now, oh, don't need to do that. Now there are some extra things sometimes we need to do. So while this is booting up, let's go check it. <clears throat> uh, more space on my computer. Nope. So it says he just wants the hard drive. It boots OS. Beautiful. Grab our PC, put in delivery, and collect. $330 for that. Nice. We got some new parts. So I usually don't read through these because um, it's nothing big. Like we'll see them in the store and we scroll through. But all right, we can discard that. Now this dude. Uh, hold up. Oh, we didn't accept that one. See, we're already making mistakes. All right, so we didn't accept that one, which means we're going to have to do it tomorrow. No big deal. My bad. All right, now this dude. Could you take a look at my PC, please? It isn't running as well as it did when I first bought it. And I've probably not been taking the best care of it. It looks a bit dirty. Could you give it a once over? You bet. <clears throat> oh, man, look at this thing. We gotta clean that. Alright. So, first things first, let's take the case off of it. Oh, wow. Man. That's a nasty PC right there. All right, let's grab our compressed air here. Blow the dust out of this thing. Man, this thing's gross. Magic. All right, so it's sort of done there. Cleaned out the dust. All right, let's remove the viruses. Let's grab our USB. And then we need to plug in the cables. So the cables can get tedious. So the first thing I, I want to do is upgrade that. So we don't have to do that anymore. Also, there usually is music to this game, but I found that it gets just a little annoying. So if you want the music to be turned on, just let me know in the comments. <clears throat> Let's add our virus scanner. See, it is nice to just like mindlessly kind of click through some of these things, you know. We have fixed others, uh, people's PCs, over the years. So this is something I do enjoy doing in my personal time. It's usually pretty easy. There's nothing too, there's nothing too crazy about it. Oh. We almost forgot. We need to install the cover. Sweet. Nice. Let's lay that down and collect our money. $200 or $100, sorry. New parts available. Sweet. Now that's in transit. All right. Oh, I almost forgot. Look at that. And power. Okay. Now, since it's the end of the day, 
we will end the first episode. If you're enjoying the series, especially this episode, make sure to click that like button. Subscribe to the channel to see more. I really hope you enjoyed this series. And I'll see you in the next one. See ya.